Hi guys, I'm Andreas. And I am Jacob. And we are Cold North Creative, a video production company from Copenhagen, Denmark, that specializes in making metal music videos. Today we will be reacting to Better Lovers, mm -hmm. uh, first track, 30 under 30. I don't know what that means. Yeah. But uh, I actually, I, I've listened to this before when it came out because I was very excited. It's How, how could this have flown under my radar for some I don't know. fucking reason? I love Every Time I Die. and. I, for some reason I haven't seen this at all. No, but so I'm fucking stoked about it. Yeah, it's uh, Greg from uh, Dillinger Escape Plan uh, on vocals, and then I think basically Just all of Every Time I Die, except for George, uh, uh, what's it called, Keith? Yeah, yeah, Keith they, Buckley. They had a nasty falling out, it seems. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't, I don't know what's the no, in I and out of it. Yeah, but there's, there's one guy versus the rest of them, you know, and. I don't want to go into this whole thing right here, no. but they had like a public dispute and it ended the yeah. whole thing badly, which is unfortunate because the band was sick, but you know. Yeah, it happens. It happens. They've been a band for so long and you know, yeah. things happen. So that's just, but uh, I was bummed just because I love the band. And yeah, uh, it was, I saw them in Coburn Hill in the fucking pouring rain, which was one of the best shows I've ever seen. So yeah. I saw them 13 years ago at Lubbin. Yeah. Small, small venue. They were doing like arena tours with Kill Switch and Cage, and then they just decided to play and <laughs> one off at Love. I, I think it was there actually. Also, yeah, yeah there was, was a sick show. Sick as people well. were hanging from the rafters. Yeah, and yeah, like, I remember yeah. that. Yeah, so good. So it's pretty fucking uh, insane that they got. It's a perfect guy. Yes. So and speaking of perfect, yeah. <laughs> we I don't know. It's not perfect. <laughs> we have a, a Patreon now, where every week we'll post like an exclusive uh, video, or maybe even uh, maybe a pre premiere, maybe even both. And you can sign up for two dollars a month, and you'll support it. what we do here. This yeah. is two guys trying to uh, make a do. living of watching <laughs> our <laughs> videos. Uh, help us out, guys, and uh, let's uh, check out Better Lovers Thirty Under Thirteen. Yeah. <laughs> His vocals are so sick. Yeah. Isn't it just Jordan and the bass player? I think it's all the members. Yeah, I just want to pick guy. And Andy. Oh, maybe it's the famous, yeah. Classic Jordan riff there. Yeah. 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 One oh. thing I like, yeah, it's out to, I'm pretty sure they just had it on like, uh, what's it called? Like, a stand. Or yeah, a stand, and standing. just, because it, yeah. Like square, almost square movements with the camera. Exactly, but that looks really, really cool. And they, do, they know, you can see that the guy who filmed it noticed the song, because it does yeah. it in sync with the beat. Yeah. Exactly. Sick. Looks dope. Yeah. Like the whole song and vibe so far, just again, it's, not, it's just a performance video, but yeah. they're just killer. Yeah, they look really cool. Yeah. And they got like their signature moves and stuff. Yeah, everybody so. of them is uh, like veterans. Yeah, exactly. Oh, oh yeah. So this is called a um, dolly zoom. It's pretty cool. So like the camera goes in and the, and then you do that, you zoom out in post or with the with the, on the lens and you get this like kind of feeling of the ca the background moving the other direction that the camera is yeah. Look at that again. That, so cool. Yeah, they do that again now. Yeah. And again there. Super simple effect, it just looks sick. Definitely. Whoa, slow. Yeah. Uh, in reverse. Jumping out. Yeah. 
<laughs> Spit it up. Yeah. <laughs> that looks so fun. Oh, it's last. Oh, wow. uh, that's also one of the things we always talk about, which they get like at some point, like maybe halfway through, you need to introduce something more, especially if it's a performance video. Yeah. And sure. now they introduce like the rotating shot. You can see him on the tracks around here. Yeah, it's so cool. Let's let's see that transition again. And also fits like. You can see like the guy who did the edit was very like, okay, the music is like, this is a fast part, so the editing is faster now, and we start doing the circular, like spinning around, yeah. It probably just had him just do that motion on the guitar, yeah. and just, just just do that for like a minute, and then I'll speed it up, so yeah. it looks like it's only like five seconds, because yeah. it looks so fast. Yeah. <laughs> so cool. Fast paced. I pretty flashy. Yeah. Uh, Wow. Yeah, he's on the tracks, yeah. 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 Probably how they made that. Yeah. Kind of thing. Okay, cool. That's such a cool idea. Oh, yeah. Oh, and then Eric Richter. Oh yeah, of course. Of course. I was thinking like halfway through. I wonder if that if it's that guy because it kind of looked like something he he would have done. Uh, ah, dude, you just get it. Yeah, that's also. The, he, yeah, he does everything I like in performance video. He's yeah. very good at like just be small subtle changes. Like when the pace of the music changes, he'll edit it different. Then like there's a part where it's kind of like more floaty. He'll kind of like slow it down. Have like mm. these fade in out transitions. All like it's. There's a lot of attention to detail. It's like a masterclass of a performance video. Yeah, exactly. How, how to edit. Yeah, how, like to how to make... How to edit a hardcore performance video. Yeah. You, you, got like one, you got one or two scenes, how to make this interesting in four minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it kept, like, usually if it's just a band performing for four minutes and there's not, like, a lot of cool editing thing, I'll lose interest. But this one is, like, so much going on, keep, keeps you engaged all the way through. Definitely. So fun. Yeah. Good job again, dude. Yeah. Same. And we need to keep an eye out for these guys because yeah. the band. I hope they. Yeah. Uh, I hope I get to see them. They they should come to Copenhagen or something. They probably will at some point. I um, hope so. I feel like because of the, the I'm about to call it the crew because of like uh, the members of the band. Yeah, all they, big. Yeah, they they are all veterans, so they should. They're probably gonna do some big tours very soon. Yeah, get on it. Yeah. See you guys in the next one. Bye bye. <laughs>